Jacqueline Shaw and I sell real estate with Hub Edge Realty. I'm actually from the state of North Carolina. I came to Boston in 1978 when I was 14 years old. I primarily grew up in the Mattapan area. I graduated from Boston English High School. I actually went to Boston College for two years and ended up leaving there and graduated from UMass Boston. I have a BA in English Literature. Um, after college, I took a full-time job at New England Life in Copley Square. It later uh, went through some name transformations, but uh, it was New England Life Insurance Company. And it was on Boylston Street, a uh, visible area. I later went on to work at what is the former State Street Research. I started out working at Jack Conway over in the Lower Mills area in Milton. And until recently, I worked for Keller Williams. I've had many interesting real estate experiences, but I would say one of my most interesting experiences was when I had a listing over in Milton and um, the seller told me that there was a ghost in the house. I was a listing agent for a property and the husband and wife were going through a divorce and they weren't talking to each other and whenever I had to communicate with them, I had to communicate through a lawyer, and it was pretty tough. Um, I like living here at Devonwood and Braintree. It's a very lovely community. It has all sorts of walking trails for the residents. We have a pool, we have a tennis court, and it's just a lovely community. People routinely walk up and down Devonwood Road. We routinely see animals in the area like deer and turkey and there's just all sorts of wildlife here. What I like about Hub Edge Realty besides the fact that it's a small office is I just love how Jonathan uses technology. I have a 16 year old and he sometimes accompanies me on showings and he's sometimes what I call my lucky charm. <laughs> A large part of my business, they're first time home buyers, so they may have had some exposure through friends or family or courses that they've taken, but once they get in that process, it really hits home for them and a lot of times they're just overwhelmed. So I show them how to take it a bit at a time and I give them information as they need it, but I try to just be there for them and let them know about all the resources that they have at their disposal, including inspectors, the relationship that you have with your lender, and just, you know, it's a lot. A lot of my business, I'd say 99% of my business comes from referrals. And actually, I have three sisters. I wanna say thank you to them because I get most of my referrals from them. Real estate is a hard business. I say it's a business that never sleeps because you need to be there for people when they want you. And it's not always when you want to be there. There are times when I've taken calls or emails at 10 o'clock at night, 11 o'clock at night. You have to be there because if you're not there, people so quickly go on to the next person online. The way I do business is I'm there from the beginning to the end. And because a large part of my business is referral business, I'm walking with you from the day we start to the day that we close on that property. I'm there. I'm at the home inspection. I'm at the appraisal. I go to the closing with you. I'm there from beginning to end. And I'm there to see you through to getting those keys and get into your new home. I never count on things going through until it's all over.